American company AM General showcased a new generation of light combat tactical vehicle named, Humvee Sabre Blade Edition. In order to respond to new threats, AM General has developed armored versions of its Humvee to meet the new tactical needs of the American Army but also to offer better protection against ballistic and mine threats such as IEDs, improvised explosive devices. With the Humvee Sabre, AM General has completely redesigned its Humvee vehicle to increase survivability with 360-degree kinetic and blast protection in a true light tactical vehicle. The Humvee Sabre is based on AM General 13 Series HMMW V4X4 chassis. The general layout of the vehicle is standard for a light tactical armored vehicle with a power pack at the front, crew and troops compartment in the middle and a cargo area at the rear. This new Humvee Sabre version features Air Environment switchblade loitering missiles, and a Hornet Air Guard remote-controlled weapon system with counter UAS solution by Hornet. The Hornet Air Guard is a secondary anti-drone capability, first presented in 2022, which complements the Hornet RCWS and its native functions, surveillance, fire, and self-protection thanks to an independent smoke grenade launcher ring. The Hornet Air Guard adds a Gonio RF, Hydra from Cerber, and a radar which are fitted on the Hornet's independent smoke grenade launcher ring. Both systems constantly scan the area while the RCWS can still be used normally for observation or combat missions. The vehicle is powered by a 6.5 LV8 turbocharged diesel engine developing 205 horsepower coupled to a 4-speed electronically controlled transmission. The vehicle can reach a road speed of up to 90 km per hour with a maximum cruising range of 402 km. The Humvee Sabre provides 360 degrees of kinetic and blast protection, including under-vehicle blast protection for the front and rear wheels as well as the center undercarriage. The vehicle can accommodate up to six military personnel. Each side of the vehicle is equipped with two doors that open to the front but the rear doors are equipped with shielding instead of conventional windows and the outside view is ensured thanks to the use of cameras. The digital video camera delivers a 60 degrees minus 120 degrees field of view live feed of the outside environment to a ruggedized low latency high definition LED display on the inside of the vehicle at the passenger's position and to the commander's display. This design eliminates the need for heavy transparent armor on rear passenger doors.